All right, folks, today I want to show you how to set a mouse or a rat trap without catching your cat. Okay, um, so first thing is you want to bait these with something that the cat might not be too interested in, um, like some peanut butter or maybe uh, get a cracker, wet it down to where it's kind of doughy and uh, put it on there, or even a piece of bread, break off a piece, roll it up, and then stick on there. So uh, that's a good bait. Um, and then what you want to do, you set your trap and you get your milk crate and you put it over upside down over the over the mouse trap and now your cat typically won't mess with it now there's no guarantee he's not gonna if you got a real cantankerous cat he's not gonna get down here and try to reach his paw in and set the trap off but most of the time um, they'll leave him alone um, if you don't have a milk crate you can even use a clothes, ba a clothes basket okay just set that over of course the holes in this, um, you know, a mouse or a rat is just going to go right through and uh, get caught in the trap. You can easily look through there and see if your, your trap has been set off. Um, and like I said, it will keep your, uh, keep your cat from messing with the trap. Now, um, also probably keep most small dogs out. Uh, if you bait it with peanut butter and you got a peanut butter loving dog like most of them are, he might try to get at this. Uh, no guarantees that he won't. Um, set you a, a 12 pack or, or a 24 pack of a beer or soda on top of this to weigh it down though uh, that might keep them out of it but again uh, the mice will be able to go in and out so try this um, if, if this is an issue for you and uh, hopefully that helps uh, I learned this from my dad um, and it works pretty good